remember that one time you said, Dad, I can't find the right person. She doesn't exist. And I told Brett, relax, you'll know when you know. And it was a few weeks later after that, he hopped a plane and little did I know that Brett had met somebody on that plane that day, and that was you. He said, Dad, I know. beginning we knew we were an unexpected pairing but we couldn't help but feel so happy together from the little things to the first time you told me you loved me and all the adventures that followed I knew I wanted to spend my life by your side I remember you telling me about Brett and how you were dating and he was just some guy in a frat. The way you talked about him and the excitement in your voice was something that I hadn't seen before. I don't say this lightly, but I really think you met your match. We were hanging out at my house one day and Brett goes, guys, I'm gonna marry this woman. And this was a month after he started dating her. Four and a half years later, here we are. It has been such a big, important part of my life, and he was his Papa Jerry's too. Um, spent many, many weekends together, did lots of special Play-Doh things and all those things. Shortly after Brett asked June to marry him, I just knew I had to offer the rings to Brett. It's okay. I took him and I had him melted together. I have a little part of me, a little part of him. <laughs> yeah. We always had thought, well, this is the kind of person that we would like to welcome into our family. And you're so much more than that. And I used to kid Brett a lot. Look, buddy, if you don't start thinking about proposing to her, we will on your behalf. <laughs> You know, June, you look good. <laughs> I'm back at the pepper mill, roaming the hallways, wishing that the minutes would go by slower. I'm at a crowded party where we couldn't even move around. You were the only person I saw. I'm walking on a frozen lake in a blizzard to ask you to be my wife. We were freezing, but when I got down on one knee, I was no longer cold just ready to live our life together. These memories, there's just a few that we've made and I cannot wait to make a whole lifetime more. You were as strong as steel and powerful when needed, much like this gift. Here's to many years of adventures. <laughs> love and straight shots. Thank you very much. How cool. Okay, here you go. lost most of his memories and talked to him like you'd known him for years. I realized on that day that you not only loved me, but you loved my family too. And what more could a girl ask for? I thought to myself, I'm going to marry that man. And I promise to love you when it's easy and when it's hard. I promise to always support you, push you, 
and help you in all of your life's dreams. And I promise to show you I love you every day, always. Unexpected, but forever happy. These last four and a half years have been a testament to the life we will share together. You are the person I feel safest with and the person I, want, I never want to be without. I promise to love you more today than yesterday, but not as much as tomorrow. I love you, Brett Arnish, and I always will. He knew the moment that he met you. And once we met you, we knew too. But when you said yes to Brett, you said yes to us. And that means a lot. There's likely nothing that's ever going to be in your way that you can't handle together. To Brett and Alexis Arnish, may you always be remarkable together. Brett, you may kiss the bride. Brett, Brett. Brett. <laughs> from all the buddy, buddy sisters, sisters, we are, are so, so glad to welcome another brother into our family. Congratulations, we love you both. Let's party! <laughs>